Hey guys, it's Melanie. Welcome back. So today kicks off my Fall Decorate With Me series for 2022. I love doing these videos and I feel like I've gotten just a little bit better at um, putting them together over the last couple of years. So now that I have some <laughs> decent basic editing skills, I feel like I can make these videos flow a little bit more nicely. So um, yeah, I'm super excited to share this year's Decorate With Me series. Um, today's video will be a little bit of an intro here at the beginning, but the subsequent videos that you will see for the remainder of the week, I will be just kind of showing you what the decor was like for the previous season and then take you through the decorating of it and then obviously showing you the finished product. Um, I will be doing a final like fall house tour at the end of this series, so look forward to that as well. I will show you all of the areas of the house that I have decorated but with this particular series, I decided to focus on a few key areas that are sort of, I guess, my favorites to decorate. And the first one is my entryway. Um, the entryway is obviously right across from the front door. So I really like to use this area to sort of set the mood for when people arrive. Um, I really want my fall decor to feel welcoming and cozy but I definitely also like to elevate it just a little bit here and there. Um, the main priority is making it feel like just a warm, cozy, inviting home. Um, but then, you know, you gotta sprinkle in a little bit of fancy lady here and there. So um, yeah, I'm not sure what I would call my decor style. Um, it's, it definitely leans very neutral. So if you are here for a lot of oranges and rusts and browns and things like that. Um, I'm probably not gonna be your girl for that. We're, we're doing a lot of beiges, neutrals, um, mauves, uh, golds, <laughs> you know, that kind of stuff. So I don't know, if you're into it, I hope that you will enjoy this series. Um, so yeah, this is, like I said, the entryway table. If you are curious about where this came from, I wish I could link it but unfortunately I cannot anymore. This was from Pier 1, back when Pier 1 was still a store that you could go inside of and shop. This was from their Delip collection. This particular piece um, had kind of a French country inspired vibe to it. And I really, like if I had the money, my whole house, like if I could build a house, it would be like French country chateau. That's really my vibe, but I can't afford that. <laughs> so <laughs> until we win the lottery, I can incorporate a few pieces here and there. This was a little bit of a splurge for me, but I absolutely love it. I store a lot of candles and stuff in here. So um, if I can find something similar, I will try to link it. But I love having this piece here because it's great storage. I can put things in there um, when guests are coming over to hide them. <laughs> um, but it's also just a beautiful piece. So. For the uh, spring and summer this year, this is the setup that I have. You will probably, this will look familiar to you if you watch a lot of my candle related content because I tend to do my candle reviews um, right in front of this piece over here. So I went and got out a few things already. I might be digging further into my closet here to get out some more stuff. But I am just going to start decorating this piece here and we're gonna see what we can come up with for this year. So sit back, um, enjoy some f fun music. I don't know what music I'm gonna pick yet, but hopefully it'll be a great choice and let's get into decorating my entryway. Let go of discard. 
Thank mm-hmm. you.